What is popping, Grapple Gang? Welcome back to the channel. I'm Cartoon Corey, and in today's video, we're going to be looking at SpongeBob Easter eggs, specifically in seasons 13 and 12. And we're going to be covering a lot of new episodes. So, yeah, stick around. Let's have some fun. Our first Easter egg can be found in the episode Potato Puff, but we need to go back to season one for it to actually make any sense. In the season one episode titled No Free Rides, Mrs. Puff as always is stressed out and defeated after yet another failed driving lesson with SpongeBob. So she decides to just give him a license anyways so that she doesn't have to deal with him anymore. Now when she gets home, if you look on the wall, there's a portrait of the exact frame on screen. This is known as a recursive image, and it's actually referenced in the opening of the season 13 episode, Potato Puff, as look, there's a portrait of the exact frame going on in the episode on Mrs. Puff's wall yet again. Pretty cool, huh? Here's a clip. Now to go home and have the rest of that pasta. <laughs> To the greatest teacher ever! Thank you, Mrs. Puff. I know I speak for everyone when I say that we consider you a member of the Square Pants family. Just let yourself out. Well, if you're sure. Yeah. See you tomorrow, Mrs. Puff. La 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 la. Maybe he really is unteachable. I give up. So in the season 13 episode, There Will Be Grease, Plankton and Mr. Krabs are forced to work together after discovering a well of miracle grease under their restaurants. They both have their own intentions with the grease. Mr. Krabs wants to use it to improve the Krusty Krab menu, while one of Plankton's uses would be to use the grease as lube for killer robots. And if you're a true SpongeBob fan, you'll notice that the robot shown in the Thought Bubble is Plankton's Tank Robot, the exact same one that appeared in the SpongeBob movie Sponge Out of Water. Talk about a cool callback. Here's a clip. Several long days later. Come on, Krabs. There's got to be some use for this stuff we can agree on. Mm, let's sell it to the military. Imagine fuel for flamethrowers, lubricant for killer robots, bombs that smell like french fries. <laughs> Our next Easter egg can be found in the season 11 episode, Goons on the Moon. In this episode, Sandy sends her science troop squad, consisting of Pearl, Squidina, and SpongeBob, into space. Well, more specifically, the moon. And this makes for a very entertaining episode, with the gang encountering all sorts of wild scenarios. Now, the Easter egg in question, or I should say Easter eggs, can be found during this scene. As within the asteroid belt, not only can the foxy grandpa hat from the episode One Crab's Trash be seen, but also Wormy from the episode titled, well, Wormy, which is pretty cool. Two Easter eggs in one episode. Here's a clip. He's a little dangerous. The juicer? Ooh. Foxy grandpa! Until tomorrow, new best friend. Don't be sad, little buddy. We'll be back first thing in the morning for frolic and fun. Why must the sun set on this perfect day? Uh-oh! Uh -oh. We've got space! Our last Easter egg can be found in the episode Squirrel Jelly, but it revolves around the season one episode, Jellyfish Hunter. This episode is pretty messed up, with Mr. Krabs sending SpongeBob to collect jellyfish jelly so he can sell it as a condiment at the Krusty Krab. Just Mr. Krabs completely abuses the situation and like creates a factory for the jellyfish. It's really sad. But yeah, one of the characters we're introduced to in this episode is Friend, aka No Name, a larger jellyfish that SpongeBob has a bond with. 
Now, since Jellyfish Hunter, we haven't seen this character. However, in the episode Squirrel Jelly, near the end of the episode, Friend from, well, the Jellyfish Hunter can be seen in the background, thus making for an awesome reference or callback to an iconic episode. I'm going to show a clip, but before I do, I just want to say thank you so much for all of the support on the channel, guys. Seriously. I say it every time. I'm Cartoon Cory, and I love you guys. Seriously. Let's all just get together and watch SpongeBob together. It'd be fun. We can watch all of the new season 13 episodes together. So subscribe. Uh, for now, though, I'll see you guys next time, and here are those clips. Peace. It's just you and me again. I've caught and named every jellyfish in this field at least once. Except you, no name. <laughs> well, my good little jelly. 